name is Tom Selner. I'm the VX76 product manager for the PRG console line. What we're showing here today is, um, uh, is the V276, which is our entry-level control console for the VX76 line. Uh, the, the console features 10 playbacks. It has the, the command keypad is the same in our entire console line. So if you if you know a V676, which is uh, our other our flagship console. There's, there's no um, relearning muscle memory. So knowing how to record cues and, and edit is the same on, on any console in our product line. Uh, the console uses uh, a Macintosh as its processor. So any Macintosh will uh, work as the processor for our, our control line. The, so basically the console is just a really great keyboard. It, um, this console is, is targeted at um, the, en the entry level market based on its price point and based on the amount of buttons and accessibility to parameters on the top level. It, uh, it, ha uh, it has out of the back of it, it has four universes of DMX, five pin, it has eight universes of Artnet. Uh, the console is, is also designed to be not only um, a tech console and a playback console, but it's also designed to be a programming console because there, there's a lot of access to manual functions. There's four encoders for, uh, for uh, based on the, on the category of parameters chosen and full-time pan and tilt. So you always have pan and tilt accessible. Um, it, uh, it comes with, in, in this uh, particular setup, we're using a, a MacBook Pro or a, a Mac, and, and a, a large uh, size monitor. You, uh, you're, uh, you're able to see the um, you're able to see the uh, the, the parameters, the, uh, the command line, and and a um, a palette layout, which which uh, ties into these hard keys right here. So so if I if I wanted to change the per, uh, the palette layout, I could simply select the category and now I, and now I can do presets. The, the other other um, powerful aspect of this console is in a console class of this size, we feel like we can um, control media servers very very well even with this small uh, footprint of a console. And if we, if we were to look at what we call our media widget, you can see the streaming. You can see the video clips that are in the media server that is also in the, in this MacBook Pro. So in the small package, you can get an, an MBox Studio media server as well as the, as the console software, and you can see that you can get the streaming video, which it, which is um, also able to be viewed right here. So that's that's the V276 in a nutshell.